everyone, so I'm super excited because today I get to share with you 15 new scents for Cannes by Victoria for July. Um, all these new scents will be available as of July 1st. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break this video into two parts. Um, and the first part and the second part are both going to contain the new scents. And at the end of the second video, I'm going to have the new sales. So stay tuned for that. And I just want to say thank you so much to Victoria and the Candleman for choosing me for this. I'm really appreciative and everything smells wonderful. So let's get started. So what I will do is I will provide you with what this new scent is, what my take on it is, and then I will give you the description for what the scent is but that's going to be on her website. So the first one is Pumpkin Apple Cinnamon Bread. Look how pretty, that's a pretty orangey color. Definitely a lot of cinnamon. It smells like a very nice baked good. After the cinnamon note, you definitely get the pumpkin. It's very, I would say, almost folly, very good, very bakery. And the description for that is sweet, creamy pumpkin, rich apple, rich cinnamon apple with a crunchy strudel base note. So you definitely get that cinnamon note in it. That's very good if you like that. The next one is blackberry cobbler. That's gorgeous. I don't know if my camera's doing it justice, but it's a very dark purple. Let me take this one out for you. This bad boy here. There we go. See? A very purpley color. And the first note you get on this one is a buttery crust. Then you definitely get that blackberry smell. And it's very, very good. It's very yummy. And the description for Blackberry Cobbler is Rich sweet blackberries resting against a buttery crusty base note heaven. And I agree. Very good. The next one might be good for the man in your life. And that is Eternity for Men. It's almost nautical, I think, like, it's not very watery, but you get that, like, almost wa summery watery scent with it. It's very cologne -y, and there's a lot of greens in it. It's very green, and that is Eternity for Men, and Candles by Victoria's scent description for that is Etern Eternity for Men by Kelvin Klein. This masculine scent possesses a blend of greens, crisp jasmine, sage, and basil, and rosewood. Hmm. It's good. The next one is Bikini Bottoms. I can't wait to smell this because it's so bright and cherry and yellow. Oh, that is so pretty. It's a fruity floral almost, where my nose is picking up on. I get peach. I don't know if I'm supposed to, but I'm getting peach. And maybe a hint of like an Edward Cullen smell. Not, if you don't like Edward Cullen, I wouldn't let that throw you off because this to me is a little bit more tropical. I mean, it's not a tropical scent, but it has like the tropical fruits almost in it that I think it smells like. It's very good, and it's a very good summary one. Bikini Bottoms. And her scent description for this, oh, there we go, top notes of lime, dew fruit, peach, orange, apple, and mandarin blends with middle notes of lily, berries, jasmine, and lavender, and sustainable with raspberry, vanilla, musk, coconut base. So it's very good. The next one is pumpkin praline. Look how gorgeous that is. It's like a rusty orange color. Oh my goodness. This smells amazing. This is going to be in my top five. It's one of my new favorites. It has that um, caramelized praline scent to it. And then it also has the secondary note is the pumpkin. So if you like the caramelized praline and pumpkin, you will absolutely love this. And that's pumpkin praline. 
and their scent description for pumpkin praline is creamy rich pumpkin with a hint of spice mixed with our amazing caramelized pralines and a hint of caramel to round out this amazing fragrance and i agree it's absolutely amazing and one of my new loves pumpkin pralines the next one is chocolate banana I love her. I love her. I love chocolate covered bananas. Oh, it smells just like that. It, you smell the chocolate first. It's um, almost like a more fudgy chocolate to me. And then the second smell you get is definitely that banana. Oh, you get more banana on the bottom. That's amazing, and I love her banana scent. I love it. I can try to have to check it out. The next one is speaking of the banana thing, banana pancake. Oh, I'll go over that description soon. So if you like country berry hotcakes, you'll love this. What you get is pancake and syrup, and the banana pancake description. There we go. It's comfort food at its finest, wrapped up in one amazing candle fragrance. I agree, very good. For the chocolate banana, sorry guys, I didn't give you a description for that one. Chocolate banana is a rich creamy chocolate and rich fresh banana, the perfect combination. I agree, very good. The next one is, ooh, I just thought, mango. Macadamia nut. So oh, pretty. <sighs> you get the mango, it's the first thing you get. The next thing you get is the nuttiness of the middle note. And a base note of almost like a floor, fruity floral. I don't know if my else is supposed to be picking that up, but it is. And it's not macadamia not that I smell though, but it definitely has that nuttiness to it. Mango macadamia nut. Her fragrance description for that is, This tropical indulgence includes sweet nectar of sun-ripened mango, ripe peach sprinkled with delicious toasted macadamia. So it is very delicious and very good. The next one is... Granny pie crust. That's good. It's very simple, very sweet, crusty. It's you don't get that buttery tone like you do with the black the blackberry copper one. This one definitely has more of that like a pie crustiness, but not the buttery. There's not as much butteriness to it, but this one I think I'm going to blend with my other scent shop to make like a create a scent. It's a scent shop. Scent shop. There we go. And I love doing that. It's one of my favorite things. So, what are we on time? What I'm going to do is cut it up here, and then my second video I'm going to go over with you the remainder of the 15 fragrances for July, and I'm going to go over with you the sale. So stay tuned for that.